Welcome, TechWikis, to another video. Do you feel like your data is secure? Maybe think again. Today, we're telling you about the top five most dangerous hackers in the world. Number five. First on our list is Kevin Mitnick, once America's most wanted hacker. Mitnick's crimes include hacking into the U.S. Department of Defense and the North American Defense Command, also known as NORAD. For this, Mitnick was arrested and jailed for five years. For eight months out of that time, he was put into solitary confinement because the judge feared he might be able to launch missiles by whistling into a phone if he had access to one. When Mitnick was released, he shamelessly hacked more companies and went on the run as a fugitive for over two years, using his skills to continue hacking while remaining untraceable. Eventually caught a second time, Mitnick finally turned white hat and started his own security firm, Mitnick Security Consulting, LLC. Number 4. Up next is Gary McKinnon, a UK citizen who hacked 97 US military and NASA computers over a 13-month period. McKinnon was accused by his prosecutors of committing the biggest military computer hack of all time. The U.S. reports he stole data and deleted files which forced them to shut down a major military network for 24 hours and caused 700,000 in damages. McKinnon left messages on the system including, Your security is crap and I will continue to disrupt at the highest levels. When McKinnon was eventually caught, he claimed he hacked the system to look for evidence of UFO cover-ups and says he found plenty. After extended legal proceedings, Home Secretary Theresa May blocked his extradition to the U.S., saving him from imprisonment. Today, McKinnon is still a free U.K. citizen. Number 3. Jonathan James was only 15 when he hacked the United States Department of Defense, as well as NASA. He stole software worth $1.7 million causing the system to shut down for 21 days. Within the software he stole was source code that controlled critical elements of survival within the International Space Station, information he could have sold for millions to an enemy country. James became the first juvenile to be convicted and jailed for hacking in the United States, being 16 at the date of his sentencing. Initially put under house arrest and probation until he turned 18, James broke his probation by testing positive for drug use and consequently served six months in a correctional facility. In 2007, when James was 23 years old, he was investigated for another hacking crime. The Secret Service raided his house, his brother's house, and his girlfriend's house. Believing they would prosecute him despite his innocence, James killed himself with a gunshot to the head. In his suicide note, he said, I have lost control over this situation, and this is my only way to regain control. We're almost there. Only the two deadliest hackers left to go. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you're enjoying the content so far. Number 2. Up next, we have a duo of hackers, Matthew Bevan and Richard Price. Together, the two British hackers attacked the U.S. Pentagon network for several weeks in 1994. They copied battle simulations, intercepted messages from U.S. agents in North Korea, and gained access to a Korean nuclear facility. At the time, the U.S. couldn't tell if they were hacking North or South Korea. Given that the duo were using American systems to do this, there was serious concern that North Korea would consider the cyber attack an act of war. As such, Bevan and Price have been accused of almost starting World War III. Thankfully, it was South Korea that they were hacking, meaning the danger was much less. The pair were caught in 1996, arrested but later acquitted. Bevan claimed his motivation, like Gary McKinnon, was to find evidence of conspiracy theories. Number 1. We know him only as Astra, which means weapon in Sanskrit. He is reportedly a 58-year-old Greek male and a cunning mathematician. He was arrested in 2008 and sentenced to six years in prison. What for? Hacking into French aviation company Dassault for over half a decade and stealing their weapons technology software and data. This data, including information on jet fighters and other military-grade aircraft, he would sell to 250 people worldwide for monetary gain. Not only is this a theft that cost Dassault $360 million in losses, it also put deadly technology in the hands of unknown users. Unlike most of the others in this list, who claim to have meant no harm, 
The faceless Astra clearly didn't care as long as he got paid. And that's it, Tech Wikis. Do you feel we covered all the most important hackers? How do you protect yourself online? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe. If your brain still isn't full, consider checking out this video on the top 10 most intelligent people in the world.